Hey YouTube, it's Tony again here. It's going on with a little vlog because it's been a while since I posted one of my newer projects. Still in progress, need to finish up the throttle. I guess I can throw you, show you the throttle setup really quick. Got a bike brake temporarily coming down to the cable. There. And this is in a rundown. I still need to make a bracket. But it's got a push mower flywheel in it, which made this little Briggs three horse freaking spunky. Well, it's actually a three and a half, but new Mercury vapor area light temporarily installed. And, oh, and it just started too. Wow. Cool. See the filaments glowing. We got a DTL photo cell on it, which should not be turning it on that e late. I mean, that early, because the LED, neither one of the LEDs are on, or an HPS, or a Mercury Vapor that are by my house, so. But the only reason I said it's temporary, as this thing's warming up, is because I can lift the fixture off the pole, it's not actually very secured. And the arc's starting to draw a little bit, but nothing, nothing much is going on. Recently, at least. Um, mercury vapor fire up. Um, sorry for the mess. But, uh, yeah. Oh, of all the freaking welders I have used, this little titanium Easy Flux 125 is the freaking best. The only thing is disadvantage of it is it takes a smaller roll, but I kind of think welds like it's a freaking $900 machine. Mercury vapor warming up a little bit more. So, I'm going to fire the brakes back up for you guys really quick. Probably get yelled at because it's right at... It's right at 736 and the city ordinance... It has a 8, so, eh, I'll be fine. Okay, 3, 2, 1. If you're wondering, no, it does not have an ARC flywheel. It's got the Poe Boy Special push mower aluminum flywheel. Mercury Vapor is fully warmed up. It's got a coated bulb on it. And I forgot to shut the shop lights off. Oops. The lights in my shop is just one little CFL, an F96 T12, and a 30 watt um, halogen. Well, an LED just turned on, so now I don't feel bad about my mercury vapor turning on easy. Ooh. Ah, the etching on this side, I was going to show you that. That's pretty neat. It's a uh, Grow Lux lamp. That's mercury starved. Nothing much. Um, I have built a trike, and I would already had it driving and rode it. And I drove it two times, and the front end snapped on me. And I said, you're done. So, I'm parting it out now. <laughs> but, yeah, it was an old beach cruiser frame. Might just sell the frame, I don't know. But, uh, junk, bent crank. That's the mower I robbed the flywheel off of. New flywheel. And I'm loving this phone. Because the camera is acting amazing on it. Taking a picture of the mercury. That's not showing from there. There it is. Beautifully lights up my backyard and my side yard. I wish I had another area light to run back here. I'll probably install one right up there soon. 
but yeah. And that's pretty much it. Um, oh, I almost forgot. Um, I don't know if I already said this, but one of my friends wants a shout out, so I'm gonna have to give a shout out to the channel. I'll link it in the description if I can. It's enthusiasm, the enthusiasm boy 21. I believe that's all one word. He records a whole bunch of light fixtures, some towers, a whole bunch of really cool stuff, street lights. So yeah, go over to his channel, subscribe to him, it'd mean a lot. If you're not subscribed to me, subscribe, because, you know, um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. The lighting in my shop hadn't changed much, the LED over there just turned on. I might make a motorized bike with one of these frames soon. LED over there, I retrofitted the other day from 175 watt probe start mount halide to I think 50 watt LED, and it's pretty bright. So, yeah, mercury vapor is very green, it's very green for some reason. That's odd. I didn't know mercury vapor was green. <laughs> Might put a coated bulb in this thing soon. The etch. You can read the etch, it's somewhere. And there you go. It's an old Sylvania, well, a newer Sylvania, but yeah. And my DTL up here is hanging in. And this has a cheap little Brinks photo, so. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So yeah, check you out a titanium welder. I think they're freaking neat. But, yeah. Oh, got a new Briggs. Along with that Briggs. Ooh, that's a pretty shot. And the thing has freaking ungodly compression. I was gonna say it took it a little bit there. Yeah. It has ungodly compression. But, yeah. Thanks for watching. Check out. The YouTube channel, I'll link in the description below if I can. The Enthusiasm Boy 21. Well, yeah, The Enthusiasm Boy 21. And subscribe to him, and if you're not subscribed to me, subscribe to me because I need more subscribers. But yeah, thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.